Hey guys, how are you doing? So, it's a little bit cold, but I wanted to tell you something. Something very, very crazy. Every person is experiencing it in his life and we must be super, super strong about it to remember always, always, always our main teacher Rabbi Nachman of Westlev told us that if a person really wants to become kosher he will have to go through thousands of up and downs in his lifetime thousands of up and downs thousands there's no other way there's no other way that a person will learn the real balance, the real faith the real wisdom of life, the real patience, how to become a nice person, a gentle person, a caring person, a loving person, if he will not, gonna go through thousands of up and downs. That's the only way in life. And not because that someone wants you to suffer, and not because that someone wants you to feel bad, just only because that's the only way to recognize the light. You can recognize the light only from the darkness. Only after you've been humbled, only after you've been ashamed in something, you suddenly can feel with your heart the pain of someone else, the sorrow of another being, of another creation. You can feel, you can care, you can think about someone else, you can relate your thoughts to someone else, you can understand him, you can judge him favorably. That's the only, only way that's why a person must go through those up and downs and when you are going through your hard hours when you're coming to those places that you are alone that you feel like you've been left behind that you feel that no one is supporting you that no one ever been in that dark place in that awful horrible humiliating embarrassing situation in his life you need to remember that the same big main teacher Rabbi Nachman of Breslev said that all of those difficulties went through on all of the real righteous people, on all of them and every single one of them, even those ones that it's written on them that they never sinned, they went through hell and not because that someone wanted them to suffer and not because someone wanted them to be humbled or ashamed, no just because of the same reason we said you cannot recognize the light unless you're aware and well know about the darkness in the same amazing backyard in the same amazing field big difficulties can happen to every person everyone can experience difficulties everyone can experience hard hours hard times Remember when you're facing your reality that you're not alone, that all of the righteous people went through the same path, was walking in the same road, was putting all of their effort to stay sane and normal and sober and awake. And Hashem Barach is helping and He brings the support and the help from heaven and the light is shining between the branches, between the cracks and He is illuminating and opening windows and outlets and giving lifelines and hands in times of sorrow and pain and He hugs and He gives love and He supports and He builds and you need to be strong never to back off from the main thing that you wanted in the beginning and don't think that you're alone in that place. Remember that all of the righteous ones, all of the truth seekers went through the same journey, the same path. They were all going through thousands of up and downs in their lives. And also I'm going through thousands of up and downs in my life. And also the squirrels are going through thousands of up and downs in their lives. So, don't be afraid and be strong and always, always, always have a Muna, have faith in yourself, have faith in Hashem.
and Hashem will bless us all with much happiness and success. Amen. It's just a temporary world that in this world, in this period of time, we have a mission. What's the mission? The mission is only not to forget the Creator, to remember that it's all Him, never to fall in the trap of all of those coverings, of all of those husks. husks.